Yo, it's time to check out Beyblade Metal Masters episodes 40 and 41, and I'm excited to see what's going to happen next. Now that we know the HD Academy isn't exactly on the up and up, and they're doing some very dangerous things with this arrangement system, which feels a lot like what Dark Nebula was doing to Ryuga back in Season 1. Before we jump in though, do me a big favor and absolutely obliterate that like button. And if you're new here and you haven't done so yet, maybe consider subscribing as well. Let's go. It's almost time for the final battle. Is it? Up against the team that just totally destroyed Excalibur, Starbreaker. Oh yeah, yeah bruh. They bring in the stars and stripes to beat your ass, dude. Like that. We just have to Probably not. Whatever strength we can muster. I'll win one and Jenga will win one. Oh yeah? Us will crush Starbreaker and get back at them for what they did because you Sebastian think you're the MC, bro. Just Tile down on that hamburger. Is sure to be part of the team in the final matches. Mm -hmm. That's a big hamburger. Who in the world would we get to add to the team? Who do you think, bro? Uh, Who do you think, bro? About Kiyoya. Oh, poor you. If Kiyoya is willing to lend us a hand, I just thought he'd be a good choice. Mm hmm. Kiyoya. So would Ryuga. So would Kenta. Oh, poor Kenta. Speak up, little what man. About, what about me? Let's go, dude. Let's go. And I've been training really hard since then, too. Yes. Come on, guys. Can I please, Jinga? Please, bro. Uh, please. Uh, Say yes. I think maybe yes. We've had Kenta on our side since the beginning. Exactly, bro. Before you, Masamune. Don't decide that just yet. Huh? What? Ah. Yo. Whoa, bro. <laughs> Always, bro. Yeah, the four thousand year thing, man. Kion and the rest of Wang Hushong will fill the hole left by Subasa and you. Wait, what? Where did you hear about that? Don't take China's four thousand year old information network lightly, my friend. What, bro? What is going on, bro? Everybody wants to join the team. So go ahead and choose. Okay. Who do you want? Neither, bro. No, we want Kiyoya. Yes. No, me, all right. And Kenta, yes. You're going to say that the the one who wins in a bay battle will become Gan Gan Galaxy's replacement member. Nah, bro, you're about 4,000 years too late. We already decided it's Kenta. The winner will become Gan Gan bro. Galaxy's replacement bro, member. Bro, imagine Kenta wipes the floor with them all, bro. Please. Please, Kenta. Let's just get this thing done. Right. Tell them to shut their mouths. Dude, it's been a while since we heard him say that, bro. Let's go. I kind of would like Kenta or Chiyun. Give us one of the short kings, bruh. That's got to represent, dude. At that level, you can't defeat me, my friend. Oh, here it comes, bro. The giraffe. The rock giraffe, dude. Oh, here we go, bro. Bringing down the lizard. Okay, okay, okay. We're still in it, Kenta. Yeah, dude. Hit him with the flame. Come on, man. What are you doing? Exactly, man. What are you doing? He's gone, too. Oh, these two sharing one brain cell, bro. Not even one brain cell. These two sharing half a brain cell. He's already out there. Launched and all, dude. Yeah, poor Madoka. Are they all going to do this back <laughs> the place is gonna blow up. <laughs> the place is gonna blow up, bro. <laughs> what is going on? Okay, this episode is very entertaining. What the actual fuck is going on, bro? Why is he here now? <laughs> what is going on? Well, we pretty much said enough of this. We already decided who's gonna join. <laughs> it's all the way up there. <laughs> That's my father. What do you mean? Aren't you the one that said we could have a replacement member for the final match? They would deciding who will be that member with a bay battle. They would find it for you. I also respect and accept your heated blader spirit, but that is all. Huh? The heck, okay. That all? That's all, bro? Yes, that is all. Gan Gan Galaxy's replacement member has already been selected. <gasps> who? It is No. Me! What, bruh? Can't compete? What are you talking about? You're the director now. What? You? My dad is the new member? Yep. 
Unfortunately, Mr. Director. Hmm? I'm afraid you cannot become the replacement. Yeah, bro. Member. Exactly. It's a little bit of a conflict of interest, man. According to the Beyblade World Championships rulebook, Chapter 5, Section 34, Article 2, any person involved with the tournament in an official capacity or any adult is disqualified from becoming There it is. I was about to say, bro, don't you have to be a certain age as well? They're, they're all kids. This can't hey, man, poor guy just wanted to spend some time with his son, you know? <sighs> my dream of joining forces. <laughs> After fake it. What I say, bro? Together. My man wanted to spend some time with his son, dude. After he uh, faked his own death last season. I want to make it up to him, dude. Championship rulebook, chapter three, section seventy-two. You must be from Japan. Person who has previously participated in the oh. tournament on any level is disqualified Woo. from becoming an alternate. That leaves Kiyoya out, but Kenta. Oh, I, I guess because Kenta did the, Kenta did the qualifier, right? So he can't do it. But Ryuga can. I guess this means Jenga and I will end up battling alone after all. Shut your mouth, bro. Shut up, Masamune. The hell, dude. Wait, what? It's gonna the hopes of all Japan's Beyblade fans. Nah. Blader DJ has come to say the heck is going on, bro. Are you telling me DJ wants to throw his name in for the supporter position as well? But he's an adult, isn't he? True. And also majorly involved with the tournament, too. True. So what's he talking about? I admire the guts it took to come alone to an away game. It's the top hat guy. Bro, are you kidding me, bro? Wait, they're gonna Beyblade against each other? To determine who does the announcing? Blader DJ. It doesn't say Japanese DJ. It says Blader DJ. Order to decide who is worthy of announcing during the final battle. It is on. Oh my goodness! What is happening? Okay, this episode is kind of crazy, man. The American DJ's bay is a rock Aries ED one four five. Oh, and it has a WBBA bowl on it, dude. It's a rare bay that you can't even get anymore. Oh, really? Oh, we got a Subasa. Uh... That model was only available at one turn. Oh, yo, Beyblade fans must have really loved this, bro. I can't believe this is happening right now, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you kidding me right now? They're going to commentate while battling. Yo, <laughs> there's no power behind it. This was a really fun episode so far, man. Dink. Bruh. Oh my goodness, dude. What an amazing farce. Right from the start, this is becoming a seriously hated battle. I think you guys are a little biased there. If you just close your eyes, this sounds like an amazing battle. <laughs> you can use your imagination, dude. Oh my goodness. Yeah, bro. Okay. Clouds coming either. <sighs> yeah, nothing is actually happening. Free, bro. What? I don't care who commentates. I just want to see the damn battles, bro. I can see. I can see that it's both bays have fallen over. Oh my goodness! It's a. It's a. It's a tie. So we should co-commentate. What they should co right. co commentate? We should be fighting each other like enemies. We should be joining forces like friends. We should announce the final battle of the Beyblade World Championships together. Yeah, so we could have we could have avoided all of that, bro. Later, DJ also deserves a big round of applause. And then they hug well, it out. <laughs> bro, my man's like that was weird. Just like this guy sitting right here at the end. Well, that's okay, Madoka. We were planning to fight the whole thing on our own from the beginning anyway. So Ryuga, bro. Give the Dragon Emperor his spot, dude. Episode 41, let's go. Bro, I'm telling you, man. Ryuga better show up, dude. He better show up. He better join the Japanese team, dude. Oh, he has an Ares, huh? I think it's finally time, Masamune. Oh, oh. What, to leave the hospital? You feeling up to it, bro? Hey, there's the man with a hard-ass name, even though he was the weakest of the I'll group. Soon, Toby. The Abyss. How then? 
I think it's about time for us to get going as well, okay? Excuse me? Yes, Dr. Ziggurat. What are you about to do? Hmm. Oh, what are you up to? Nah, don't be looking at him with a soft facial expression. This is the final battle, and Starbreaker is gonna go down. <laughs> Even if my old pal Zeo stands in the way. Okay. My man's, my man's ready. Okay, Masamune. Oh, what's going on here with, uh... Oh, yeah. Yeah, this ominous crap, dude. It is pretty wicked, man. What happens if he loses? What's that supposed to mean? From the beginning, there has always been the agreement that you produce results. <gasps> if you lose, Toby's medical treatment will be cut off. Yeah, bro. <gasps> this is gonna this is gonna push him, dude. Arrangement complete. Arrangement rate one hundred percent. So they have to do this every time. It's like making them one with their Beyblade, like with the Requiem Project in Burst. Is that what it's doing? Yo, is that the same? Uh, Dudes that gave Masamune a ride, bro. Let's go, dude. There they are, bro. Look at this team, bro. Damien has that fit. Look at this, dude. High collar, cape, crazy looking hair. He has the least unique design, but he has one of the hardest names, bro. Jack the Ripper, baby. Damien. Bro, I'm telling you right now, he's going to show up. He better show up, bro. I need Ryuga versus this little dude right here. I need Ryuga versus Damien. I need it to freaking happen, bro. From Team Starbreaker, first up is Zeo Abyss. Let's go! Masamune's going, bro. <gasps> Zio's going first? Well, guess that's me. <gasps> There's no problem, right? None at all. He's all yours, Masamune. Bro, I, I don't even have a clue who could win this, bro. Because the writers do not like giving this character a W. Huh? But hmm. Zio and Masamune are our good friends. It doesn't really matter who wins, does it? Okay, Coach uh, Steel, let him know, bro. <laughs> Spin the win, baby. Let's go. The title of the world's strongest is at stake. All right, baby. Let's go. Three, two, one. Look at this guy and his little rodent creature. Whatever the heck that is, bro. Beat the red solo cup spin track, dude. The OST, baby. Yeah, he's definitely. I feel like the enragement system's doing something to him, man. He's being irrational. Doesn't matter, bro. All he has to do is put all that power into the point. Come on, man. Why doesn't he seem worried, though? Let's go, bro. Hit him with go it. Now, Use the old man's training, dude. It's no use. Fix this. Destiny Nito. Oh boy. It's when he controls the Beyblade, right? What is this? Oh, Fixus is surrounded by a strong magnetic field. And what does that mean? Strong lines of magnetic force are grabbing hold of Striker and moving it. <laughs> what? What is going on? And Striker? since it made a metal. It works. Wouldn't work in plastic gen, I guess, right? Okay, Zeo's putting up a fight. Okay. Okay. Yeah, bro. Hit him with a aerial strike, dude. Jump, dude. Oh, oh, he might just do it when he has enough power, bro. Dude. 
this new weirder you, you bro. Something that you create with your own power. That's right, bro. Here it comes, dude. Broke through, dude. Now it's time to hit him with the PowerPoint needle, bro. Yo, hit him with the unicorn horn. Is it enough? Is it enough, though? That tip is taking it. Well, spin track, really. What's going on? Why is it glowing? Oh, it's from the, them spinning against each other. Bro, what is about to happen? Is he about to, like, release power or something? Desperation's gonna push him forward, bro. Wait, what the heck did he just click, bro? He injects steroids? Are you kidding me, dude? Oh, bro, he didn't hit 100. He was at 92 still. Interesting. Now the arrangement index seems to be rising rapidly. Rapidly? I didn't think it was. I don't think it was really rapidly, bro. But yeah. Masamune, you are the one person I will not lose to. I simply won't lose to a traitor. What's happening, Zio? Well, bro, what is gonna happen to this man? Bro, is he gonna mutate? Do you see his feelings, how they're being amplified because of this? Wait, what? But it's not. That's, see. This is where the arrangement system is making him unreasonable, I feel. Ooh, got back up and build up some poil. Yeah, bro. Yes, build up some power, bro. Let's go. From above. I don't think it's going to be enough, though. Something's about to happen, bro. What is about to happen to Zio, bro? If I lose, Toby will die. Dude, did he just hit 100%? <gasps> bro! My man's like... <laughs> Magnetic Needle Storm. Oh, that's quite bright, dude. Uh, uh, what? Damn, knocked him the hell out. Knocked him out before his Beyblade even hit the ground, dude. Okay, uh, Zio Abyss. Are you okay, bro? Bro, pushing himself to 100% like that, I don't think it's going to have a good outcome, bro, if he does it again and again and again. Oh, bro, if he's knocked out, they're going to need another member or Jing is going to have to go back to back. So they are up to something. Uh-huh. It seems there's no doubt now. Dr. Ziggurat, huh? Jenga! Yeah, bro, you know him, dude? Dude, can Jenga go back to back or no? Or is Ryuga going to have to come because our dude Masamune is knocked out, bro? Are you kidding me? Called it, baby! Let's go! Let's fucking go, dude.